Mayor, back to yeah. the Bears. Um, oh, yes. <laughs> we've noticed that your tweet was deleted from your account after you first back last summer. Mm -hmm. uh, in June of last year when you said the Bears should be concerned with putting a winning team on the field and being relevant mm -hmm. past October. Do you regret that initial reaction? Um, I'm not aware that it was deleted, um, but no, I don't, I don't regret that. I think, look, you know, I was being a little tongue-in-cheek, as every Bears fan is, as we're sitting here, you know, a couple days removed from the Super Bowl and we're watching um, the uh, folks in Philadelphia, um, hopes dash. I think a lot of people felt like Philly was a team of destiny. I know I did. Um, um, I'm happy for uh, the Kansas City Chiefs and have a good relationship with the mayor there. Um, but look, you, you, you know this. What is the main product for the Bears? That Bears is the Bears' main business is putting on a high-quality team that can go out and compete and beat the Packers, um, win the division, and then go on to the playoffs and be successful. Every Bears fan that I know wants this team to be great and dynamic and go deep into the postseason. But that has neither here nor there about where we are right now regarding uh, the stadium. But did style-wise, do you wish perhaps is that the best way for the mayor to reach you know, out to the Bears? Uh, look, I, I, I'm. You okay? Yeah. All right. Uh, look, I'm dealing with the here and now, and I'm excited for the opportunity for us to make the business case um, to have the Bears stay um, in our city. You know, we've demonstrated that the number of opportunities that they're going to get um, with the number of tourists that come to our city every year, um, the amount of, I think, additional revenue opportunities that can be generated um, from Soldier Field, those simply can't be matched, particularly when you're thinking about um, the possibility of building a brand new stadium. If you look at, for example, SoFi um, in, uh, right outside of uh, Los Angeles in Inglewood, you look at the stadium that was built uh, in Las Vegas, those are four and five billion dollar stadiums um, and the Bears haven't even put a shovel on the ground yet for Arlington Heights. I don't know where that money is going to come from. Um, you know, you've seen the polling that says the people in the village of Arlington Heights are all excited about it, but they don't want to pay for it. Um, you know, I think you've, we've seen um, at the state level um, there's not an appetite for uh, a municipally uh, finance or a, a state a government funded um, stadium and legislation that was passed in the last session um, that wouldn't allow for a state subsidy for a team that moves from one location in Illinois to another location. So, you know, they're, they're smart business people. Um, they're going to look at and evaluate what the opportunities are. And my belief is that the best case business um, scenario for them and having a great stadium, having um, uh, being truly in the best market uh, for them in the country is remaining at Soldier Field, working with us uh, to modernize that stadium, to meet their needs, um, and to increase revenue opportunities, which I think are really boundless um, at Soldier Field. So that's, we're going to keep um, focusing on that and look forward to uh, further engagement with that. I, I wanted to keep